I do. I can't even go to sleep. When I went to see Santa, I forgot to ask him something really, really important. And I need to go talk to him before he goes back to the North Pole to start giving out all the presents for the kids. What am I going to do? Maybe Titi will take me. Well, let me just change. Okay, now that I'm all dressed up, maybe if I ask Titi, she'll take me. I don't know, it's pretty late. I know Titi really needs her beauty sleep, if you know what I mean, but I, I need to ask her. Uh, Titi, we need to talk. You really got to take me to go see Santa. Goldie, it's so late. What are you talking about? I'm so tired. Please, Titi, I really, really need to go talk to Santa. Goldie, I'm so tired. Uh, at least tell me what it is. What's so important that it can't wait till morning? Uh, I'm sorry, but I can't really tell you. It's secret stuff. I can't tell you. It's secret, okay? I need to tell him in person. Can't be by email or, or, or mail or anything like that. It's between me and Santa, you know? Well, I guess it's not that important if you can't tell me. It can wait till the morning. It's the middle of the night. I'm going back to bed. You should too. How does she think I'm just gonna go back to sleep like nothing happened? Nope, nope, nope. I'm just gonna sneak out and go real quick. No one will ever notice. Oh, I hope this doesn't get me on the naughty list. Come on, I'll take a little cookie for the road. Hey, right, let's go. Let's go see Santa. Oh, brother, it's snowing. It's really chilly. Thank you. Thankfully, I have my uh, polka dot scarf, but my my skateboard's not working. I'm gonna have to take the bike. <laughs> it is chilly. I hope Santa's working. It's really dark and kind of spooky. Oh, well, I am I am on a mission. I need to get this done right away. Okay. Let's just hope that there's not, like, much spooky stuff outside. Okay, Ooh, it is chilly. Alright, Santa, here I come. I don't know if Santa will even listen to me. What if he's not working? What if he's on lunch break? Oh. Okay, Bloxburg is a little creepy this late in the night. But please, Santa, please, Santa, be here, be here. Yes, he's still there. Oh, it's my lucky day. I better park my bike right here and, and give him this cookie. Yeah, he loves cookies. Um, excuse me, Sandy. Um, um, I'm Goldie. Remember me? I brought you a cookie. Hey, Goldie. Haven't I seen you here before? Oh, well, you actually saw me like a couple of days ago, but I forgot to ask you something really super duper important. Uh, yeah, so, uh, here's a cookie. <laughs> hey, Goldie. Does your mother know you're here so late? My mom? Uh, well, yeah, of course, she knows. You know, she told me I could come and see you in the middle of the night. <laughs> in the middle of a snowstorm. <laughs> well, I'll cut to the chase. The reason I'm here is because I want to ask you for a special Christmas wish. I wish that you help Titi, my mom, fall in love and find her perfect match and get married and have happy happy and we can be a big happy family. I've tried setting her up on a bunch of dates and she's just like a difficult picky person or something so I need your help. So did you get all that? Can you help me get Titi to fall in love and get married? Well, true love, huh? I don't know. I'll try my best. Now go home. Get some rest. Alright, Santa. You go and try your best. Don't forget I gave you one of my last special gingerbread cookies. Bye, Santa. I better get home before Titi realizes I'm gone. Boy, oh boy, I hope Santa will make my wish come true. I want it more than a new iPhone. Well, not that much. <laughs> yeah, I do. I really, really hope my wish will come true. Okay, I better be real quiet and get back to bed before Titi knows that I snuck out of the house or I'm going to be in big trouble. <sighs> I hope it was worth it. <sighs> oh, I'm really sleepy now. I hope Santa will not put me on the naughty list for sneaking out. And he'll make my wish come true. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs>
Ahem. We are gathered here today to celebrate the love and wedding of my mom, Titi, and my coach, Kochi. Say hi, Kochi. I'm just going to get right to the ceremony so no one has any chance to escape. Don't get any ideas, okay? <clears throat> I mean, let's carry on with the ceremony. Kochi, do you take this lady, my mom, as your wife through weird times and happy times, through her cranky, cranky moments, and also with her beautiful daughters, myself, Goldie, and that little cutie over there, baby Bloxy. You basically have to be there for her throughout all the good and the bad times. What do you say, Kochi? You have to say something. Okay, good. Um, I wasn't done, actually. You also promised to take off on fun rides and give me unlimited supplies of ice cream whenever I demand it. And I won't take advantage of it, I promise. Good. I do. Wonderful. Um, now it's your turn, lady. Do you take Kochi as not only your soccer coach, but your beloved husband through good times and bad times to make him breakfast sometimes and to never love him more than you love me and Bloxy because we are the number ones in your heart. To be there for him through the good, the bad, and the ugly, but mostly for us. I do. Okay, that settles it. Um, <clears throat> with the power invested in me in the city of Roblox, I now pronounce you husband and wifey. You may kiss your bride on her cheek, of course. Ugh. Ew, girl, they're kissing. Hey, Bloxy, mommy is married. Are you talking to a stranger guest here? Bloxy, did you invite this lady to the party? I don't really know her. Bloxy, aren't you excited? Mommy is married and Koji is our new dad. I think that was a beautiful moment and very romantic wedding. I agree. Wait, Bloxy, you don't know how to talk. Something's going on here. Where are these butterflies coming from and they're making me real dizzy? Titi, what are you doing? You can't marry Kochi. You barely know him. And what's this place? That's not even... There's not even a real cake. Ah, get me out of here. Hello, where am I? The sky's not supposed to be pink. No. What's going on? Bloxy, stop talking. You're just a baby. You're not supposed to talk yet. No, what? Huh? It was just a dream. Oh, brother. What in the world, oh, brother? That was just a dream. I gotta be real careful with what I'm dreaming about, you guys. Oh, that was just really weird. I should probably go check up on Bloxy and make sure that everything's okay with her. Bloxy, oh, she's sleeping. She's not even inside her blankie. Come here, Bloxy. Sorry to wake you up. I just wanted to make sure you were okay. I had a really weird dream. I also want to remind you to be careful what you wish for because sometimes it may be crazy. Good night, baby Bloxy. I love you. Oh, good. Oh, I'm gonna check up on TD one last time to make sure nothing weird is happening with my dream. Oh, brother, I really need to stop dreaming these crazy dreams. Oh, Titi snoring. Oh, poor Titi, she has no clue. Oh, well, this was such a crazy, crazy adventure, but I'm glad that she's not really getting married. I don't need to be pushing that on Titi. She'll do it when she's ready. Well, guys, Thankfully, it was just a dream. I hope you enjoyed this video. And don't forget to like and subscribe. And also, tell me what other videos you want to see. Because I love making them and I am on vacation. Wait until break vacation. <laughs>